The purpose of this video is to show you how Odoo's uh, external ID can be used to update uh, records that already exist in uh, the Odoo database. So first thing we're going to want to do is let's go into the contact app, take, keep it very simple. I'm going to list view, we have contact John Doe. When I click into this, you can see here John Doe, um, right, you can understand the particular ID for John Doe here, and you can see the table or the model res.partner which this record lives within. Now, if I want to make an update to this record for John Doe, what I'm going to do is I need to get the external ID. So I'm actually going to select John Doe, action, export. I don't want, uh, I want the display name and I want the external ID here. And I want to push out via CSV and export. And just like that, it will push out a CSV file and here it is. So here's, if I want to update John Doe's record, I need this here. Okay, so let's now take this and let's go over here. And I'm going to remove this information. And all I need is the external ID. And Odoo will say, okay, now that you have this external ID for partner number 10, it knows that, okay, whatever other fields you want to update here about you know, regarding John Doe, go here. Right, if I want to update the phone, mobile, email, right, it's going to tell me you can update those fields. Uh, you just need to uh, plug values in. So if I didn't have an external ID and I updated with a display name, it would create a brand new record, right? So simple. If I want to update an existing record in Odoo, get that unique record's external ID, and then you can update those values. So for example, let's take phone and then um, email. And now I can then file download as a CSV. And if you have Excel, you can just, it's probably cleaner, but you get the idea. Now, what I'm gonna do is go here to John Doe, import, and just like that, when I click test, I don't need a name, everything seems valid, it knows, okay, here's your external ID, and I import. And just like that, John Doe's still there, and I have the, the phone number and the email automatically updated. And now, if I want to, right, if I don't use the external ID, for example, and I instead put John Doe with those values, because there's no external ID that I'm referencing, Odoo thinks, okay, we're not referencing an existing record in the database. We want to create a new record. Uh, and for this, if I, of course, go to import my records, load file, and for this, you would have, you know, it'd be your name, no external ID. And if I import, then it creates a new John Doe. So that is the purpose of the external ID. If, I, again, just to reiterate, if I want to update an existing record in Odoo, like demo one is an existing record, Nicholas Kaczynski is an existing record, then I need that record's external ID. Once I have the external ID, then I can plug values in for any other field on the table. And when I import it, it will change the values held in any of those fields. Okay? So if you have any questions on how this works, feel free to let me know. I'll be happy to elaborate further. Thanks.